To the new case count for COVID now, and once again, the situation is grim as the province breaks infection records and fails to slow the spread of the virus. Our Legislative Bureau Chief Bender Sajjan joins us. And Bender, these numbers suggest what the province is currently doing may not be working. Yeah, Scott, and more than a week into new provincial restrictions and we're breaking all kinds of records. The question, should the province take stronger action? Well, Adrian Dick says more information is coming next week. And Dr. Bonnie Henry says she is speaking daily with others about whether more controls are needed. Let's take a look at the case numbers. 911 new cases pushing our case count above 30,000. The curve continuing its rapid growth. Sadly, 11 more people have died and we're closing in on 400 deaths. Hospitals around BC are caring for more than 300 COVID-19 patients. Dr. Henry says when they find clusters, even those who don't have symptoms are now being tested as they try to curb the spread of the virus. Those clusters also tend to push case counts up. If you are opposed to wearing a mask, then I ask you to shop online, order takeout, or stay outside or stay home. We have people who are suffering in our hospitals right now and their families are suffering too. And that these small, simple actions make a big difference for all of us. She adds indoor group fitness classes won't reopen for another week as guidelines still aren't ready due to the complexity involved. And we can confirm for you tonight that there has been one positive case of COVID-19 at the Ministry of Health office here in Victoria. The ministry won't comment, citing confidentiality, but says it has safety plans in place. Scott? All right, thanks, Bender.